Dayton Interventional Radiology, we have an expertise in treating back pain that uh, many doctors may not be um, able to diagnose. And as a radiologist, what we have at our disposal is something that a lot of other doctors simply don't have, and that's all this imaging. And so what we do is we use the tools that we have, and we come up with a, a, um, a treatment approach saying, okay, well, you know, it looks like your pain's really coming from the joints here. Let's focus on the joints first. Or maybe your MRI showing that you have a little hairline fracture at this bone. Let's consider putting a little bit of bone cement into this area and see where things go. On the other hand, there are, there are a small number of patients who come into our office and they have a major surgical emergency in what's going on with their back, in which case we send those patients directly to our uh, neurosurgical uh, colleagues. And even after surgery, a lot of these patients will have residual pain. About 15-20% of patients who have back pain, they have long-standing pain, either from the point of view that their back pain was never really addressed from the surgery, it never really got fixed, either it wasn't the source of the pain or they may have new pain. So what do you have is you have a huge population of patients who have chronic back pain who are told the only option they have left is pain medicine. We have a treatment protocol where we start with the basics and the simple things. If it's something that we have a high index of suspicion based on our imaging and our physical examination, then we'll try to address that issue first. Maybe it's a joint problem, maybe it's a disc problem, uh, maybe it's a, a severe muscle strain that nobody's really been able to address. We'll offer them some of these minimally invasive procedures uh, to see if we can fix something like this. But if not, we, we have something else that uh, we can offer the patient. And usually for these patients, they are usually good candidates for the uh, spinal cord stimulator. This is uh, something that has the ability to cover all the pain that the patient may have. Many times we cover pa all pain between the chest and all the way down to the toe. This is a up and coming kind of a revolutionary way of treating back pain and in a, in a nutshell it's, it's a modality intended to sh somehow short circuit the pain perception that's going to the brain uh, without going into too much detail.